What's going on YouTube? SciGuy29 coming at you for a slightly different video. As you can tell, I'm not downstairs in my basement. Uh, do have a beverage, a little nitro milk stout in the beautiful St. Patrick's Day can. Uh, just wanted to talk briefly today about podcasts and wanting to know what, uh, what you might be listening to if you're listening. Uh, I'm out here uh, doing a little grilling. Turn the camera here. Got some thick cut Iowa chops on the grill. Finally got it fixed. So I thought I would uh, see if I can get this done a little differently. Um, oops. There we go. A little better angle for you. I'm in my garage. You can see it's a mess. But... Uh, just wanted to share some thoughts on uh, some podcasts and, and share some of them that I listen to and uh, would love to hear in the comments about any that you listen to that I maybe don't know about because, uh, you know, I truly want to keep learning and the only way to do that uh, is to seek other people's knowledge. Uh, the podcast is a great way and, you uh, you know, I, I love hearing other people's thoughts and insights. Don't always have to agree, uh, and that's great. Uh, one of these podcasts I'm going to mention in a little bit. It's what I've been listening to for about a year and a half now, um, and they uh, start off, I agree with about everything they said, and as it, as it continued on, um, I, there's some things I've found that I don't. So uh, just want to share some of these, uh, give you the opportunity to check some of them out uh, as well. First one, a couple of these are YouTube. Uh, you can find on YouTube specifically. Uh, two or three of them I don't think are, uh, but uh, certainly one of those things you can check out. going to apologize if all of a sudden you hear a train going by about eight, ten blocks from the train tracks. And, uh, it's incredibly windy, which is why I'm grilling in my garage today. But uh, first one is about the cards, uh, about the cards, and that's here on YouTube. You can find it um, on Spotify, TuneIn, uh, Apple, all those. All your, the regular spots you're going to find a podcast. You'll find it. But I, they're Wednesday night. Uh, they're live. They go live on YouTube. Uh, Tim Shepler is kind of the host. Big Shep. I think it's Big Shep 79 is the, uh, the uh, sorry, somebody walking by. Uh is kind of the host, and, and that Big Shep seventy nine is is at Big Shep seventy nine is his uh, Twitter. Uh, I'm, he's got two other hosts for the life of me. I should have looked it up, written it down. Uh, but it's great. Uh, it's 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 late on Wednesday night for those of you that don't live on the West Coast. Uh, so I rarely catch it live, but it's one I try always try to listen to uh, every week. Lots of insight. Uh, they have guests. Uh, just just some fun banter back and forth. Uh, also on YouTube is the Golden Age of Cardboard with Mike, uh, baseball collector, uh, on part of the Bench Clear Network, and uh, I love that one because it's going back and looking at vintage cards. Uh, focus on vintage cards. About the cards is is a much more uh, current or up to date, I guess, card look, uh, but. Uh, you know, Golden Age of Cardboard is a much more uh, vintage look at things. Uh, so I highly recommend that. Uh, not a set time or date for that one, but uh, always fun. Uh, good listen. Mike has had some guests as well. Uh, if you love vintage cards, that's one uh, for you certainly to check out. Uh, another one I have is Let Me Get That Potograph. Uh, I listen to that on TuneIn.com uh, or the TuneIn app. And... Uh, just a wide variety of topics, guests, uh, ideas, thoughts shared. Uh, another one is Sports Card Nation uh, that I listen to. Same thing, uh, also on uh, TuneIn. It's one of those things I can get uh, on my phone. I've got apps for the TuneIn app, but I can also pick it up when I'm at school working uh, and just put something on to listen to uh, as well. Uh, another one is uh, Sports Cards insights with dr james beckett uh the one thing i really like about that is uh they're typically shorter uh they're most of those i believe are 15 minutes or less uh which a lot of times are great 
Uh, my parents live about 15 to 20 minutes away uh, from where I live. So uh, it's, it's, it's a good one show listen if I'm going to visit them. Uh, you know, I, I don't, my commute is about four minutes from my house to the school where I teach. So I, just, I don't get a lot of time there. So mine is uh, at off times when I'm doing work otherwise. Um, the last one I want to share is, is a hockey card podcast. And it's called The Puck Junk. And it's hosted by Sal Berry and Tim Parrish. Uh, you can find Sal Berry. If you Google Sal Berry, you'll find him. Uh, Google The Puck Junk. Uh, they do have a website as well. They sell some T-shirts. Uh, Tim Parrish, uh, his uh, Twitter is the real DFG at the real DFG. Um, so uh, just a good, fun uh if you're into hockey at all, uh, they cover the hockey market really well. Um, have some fun. Not much for guests, uh, but and they're they're kind of sporadic with their their episodes. It's it's here and there, kind of all over the place. So, um, just wanted to share some of my favorites with you and get your ideas on ones that you might listen to that I might be unaware of and might want to check out. So, like I said, always wanting to learn. And, and keep moving forward uh, with the hobby. So hope you enjoyed it. Uh, let me know in the comments down below uh, what you come up with, uh, anything you might listen to that I did not mention. And remember, collect what you love, love what you collect.